right, we're gonna kick this off with our thing category. And I can let you all know that this thing's a book, okay? It's a book. Has this book, was it written in the 19th century? No, it was not. Hi there, Lauren. How are you? Welcome to Person, Place, Thank or you. Thing. Thank you. So your favorite thing, it's your skateboard? Yes. Do you do, are you an avid skateboarder? Um, I don't do any tricks or anything, but me and my dad, we skateboard a lot together. He's 50, he still skates, so. Oh my gosh. Shout out to my dad. Yeah, yeah shout out. <laughs> I'm as old as your dad. <laughs> I can't skateboard. Um, <laughs> that's very, very cool. I love that. Okay, well, we're talking about a book uh, okay. was not written in the 19th century. Is this book a part of a series? Yes, okay. it is. It is. Hi, Taylor. Hello. Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing. Thank you. I have to say, I admire, I'm loving the mustache, the facial hair. You're rocking it. Well, the stash abides, just like the dude abides. The stash abides. So you, this is something that you've had for with you for quite some time. Let's just say that my dad and his dad before him all had pretty thick mustaches. Pretty thick mustaches. <laughs> well, if this game goes on for a little bit longer, mine will start coming in. Um, <laughs> all right, so we have a book, uh, not written in the 19th century, but part of a series. Is it fiction? Yes, it is. Time for a clue. Get your buzzers out. You buzz in, you got it right, you got 100 points. If you're wrong, you're out until I give another clue. These dystopian tales inspired some readers to take up archery. Daryl? Is it the Hunger Games? Yes, the odds are ever in your favor today, Daryl. 100 points to you, yes. Okay, Lauren.